first impressions um, of this piece of jewellery are that it's, uh, I knew it was big, but probably a little bigger than I expected and slightly heavier as well, considering it's made from plastic. Um, I feel a bit regal wearing it. Like It's like a big posh collar. Um, I feel like I should be waving at all the subjects <laughs> around. Um, I think it's made of plastic, it seems, or like card laminated. Um, it's quite heavy though. Um, so quite considerable amount of plastic. When the artist was making it, I think because I feel like my head's on display, it's probably that was part of the purpose. Obviously, it's the flower petal, um, and inside the middle of the flower where my head is would be where like, all the pollen and, and the centerpiece of the flower. So I think it is, it's like a display thing. It's like focusing whoever's wearing it or focusing the attention on their um, head mainly and, their, and sort of that's the point of their personality and that's everything and yeah I think it's to do with display and and showing off. I don't think that this necklace or collar um, is particularly old considering the materials it's made from um, and it's of good, of good quality as well so I reckon it's only a couple of years old. I chose to wear a white dress with the, with the collar today because of the fact it is so big and um, and so sort of in your face that if you wore anything other than something quite simple and minimalistic, that I think it would just be too much. The point of this is that the focus is on the collar as a whole. It's not really something that needs to work with another big, bold piece of outfit. So I think wearing something like a simple white dress um, goes perfect with the boldness and brightness of this collar. I can't really imagine wearing it with anything else. Um, <laughs> other than perhaps a green dress, but then that'd be full flower. So uh, probably just uh, something, like I say, something minimal um, and light coloured. Um, if we're talking celebrities, I think the first one that comes to mind that would wear this is obviously Lady Gaga, because um, this is the type of thing that she wears or is known for wearing. Um, and then you've got the other side, um, Nicki Minaj, again, quite a similar character, which is all about eccentricity um, and being on display and, and everything like that. So. They're the, the two that spring to mind, particularly Lady Gaga. I'd probably wear this to something where it doesn't matter if you're a bit eccentric and over the top. Um, maybe staying away from like a, a christening or something like that, but perhaps, you know, to an eccentric wedding or, um, you know, a party where the point is to dress up, but it would be sort of awkward to wear. So you need somewhere to be uh, quite open and spacious. So you never know, like a county... Uh, a county fair or something like with open spaces that would be good but I, I do feel like I can strut around in this so it's uh it's quite cool and I feel like I could walk into a room and be like hey <laughs>